Hi guys, welcome back to Roasted Studios. Thanks so much for joining me today for a video. Be sure to hit the like button to show support. You guys seem to really like that Shamrock Shake video, and I don't blame you. It was pretty good. Um, so I wanted to offer another video today where I try some products here that I got at Cabela's. Now, this one is glazed pecans. Don't those look yummy? See that? And of course, my cat helped himself to the bag already. See, he chewed it. Nom, 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 nom. Okay, so basically, I'm going to try these for you. And they have this in the store, and usually they serve them hot. And these ones just come in the package, but they usually have the glazed pecans. They have walnuts. I think they might have cashews. But we're going to be trying the pecans for today. Also from Cabela's, Rocky Road Fudge. Doesn't that look good? They had peanut butter fudge also. Maybe I'll try that one next time. Let me get that up to the camera. Doesn't that look good? Okay, so I'm going to be trying these right now, and I'm going to let you know how they are. Okay, so let me get my little plate over here. Okay, let's open this up. Not that my cat didn't already help himself. I might just have to tear into it like an animal because that's how I open everything. I just like rip it open. Okay, I'm sure there was a more delicate way of doing this. Okay, I would like for you to try this as well. Okay. Please take this and let me know how you like that glazed pecan from Cabela's. And here's mine. I'm going to try mine right now. Oof. It's very subtle, sweet, nice, crispy glaze on there. Not very sugary. Not super sugary. I like it. It's almost like eating pie. It is like eating pie, and it is subtle. I have a taste bud or something that just exploded over here when it went in my mouth and I was chewing on it. Did that happen to you? Oh, it didn't happen? <laughs> it's just me. Um, anyways, yeah, pretty good. It's kind of like maple almond. You know what? I will say I've had the ca uh, the cashew ones before. I think we had the walnuts before also, no? And those ones are just as good, if not better, really. So you definitely want to try these. And especially if they serve them warm in, in the stores, which usually they do, um, you can get them warm, and it's just, like, really, really delicious. Okay. Now, really, there was something that, like, ooh, yummy. It's like a burst of flavor. Let me just pull the tab in. Pull the tab. Sorry, guys, I don't know how to open anything. Like I said, I open things just willy-nilly. I'm going to smell this. Oh, yes. Please take a... Please smell this. Please smell. It smells like perfection. It smells like a fresh, like, cake, doesn't it? Like brownies or something? It smells like fresh brownies or cake. It just smells delicious. I'm pretty excited about this one. I'm just going to cut a little piece so we can both try. It comes with this little... There's our little knife right there. Get a little piece right here for you. Put it on this plate here. And I'm going to give you this with the fork. And here is our first bite. Go and try that. This is Cabela's Rocky Road Fudge. Let me know how you like that. Oh, it's chewy. Is it good? It's like soft and chewy. It almost tastes like frosting. I want to try the peanut butter one too. Tastes like frosting? It tastes like frosting. Does it taste like fudge? Frosting. It's kind of fudgy, frosting. All right, guys, I'm going to take a pretty decently sized bite here. Okay, here's Rosa Sudo bite, right? Try it out. Yes. Yes. Just like Grandma made around the holiday time. Mmm. I got fudge once a year. I went to the holidays with my grandmother's. This reminds me of that. It tastes like Rocky Road. It's yes. fresh. Yes. Can we get the peanut butter one? Yeah, we can get the peanut butter one next time. I think oh my good. goodness, you guys. I think the marshmallow flavor is very subtle. Yeah. It is good, huh? It is subtle. You could probably even take these pecans and just load it up on your uh, fudge right there. Couldn't you? You could do all sorts of things. It's delicious. This would make a really good little birthday cake also. Yeah. You know, I mean, you could do so many different things. We used to do cookie cakes, birthday cakes, you can get some fudge, um, the little hostess cupcakes, you can get those and just make your own little birthday cake there too. 
Anyways, what would you give this, like a 1 out of 10, each product? 10 being the best, 1 being, oh, that's absolutely horrible, I don't want to ever eat that ever again in my life. What are you going to give the pecans, the glazed pecans? I, I would give the pecans probably about an 8. An 8? Yeah. I'll give them a 7. Yeah. 7, They're pretty yeah. good, but they're not, like, out of this world. They're not, I think you can, the cashews and the walnuts are better, to be honest. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, 7 and an 8 on this one, right here. But this would make a nice stocking stuffer, too, around the holidays, or even a present. So think about that one. Okay, one out of ten for the Rocky Road Fudge. Ten being the best, one being and eh, not so great. I'll probably give this one about a seven. A seven? Yeah, it reminds me of like the frosting on the top of the Hostess cupcakes. Yeah, it does taste like that. Um, I'm gonna give it a I'm gonna give it a seven also. Yeah, but, that, but you know what? I'm, I'm gonna try that peanut butter one, and when we buy it, we'll make a little video about that, and we'll let you know and compare the numbers. Okay, guys, let me know what you think about this review. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for tasting these samples. Oh, you're very welcome. Be sure to hit that like button. Thank you so much for all your support. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Have you tried these products? Let me know. Take care. Roasted Studios.